Good morning, everyone. This is Ta Creek Rock back for another exciting day here on the Ark Survival Evolved Ragnarok map. This is day 11 of my little adventure here, and I'm up to level 27 now. But I've been sitting out here all night watching a T-Rex kill everything on the beach down here. So I pulled out here a little ways from the beach so he wouldn't come to me. There was a bunch of parasaurs and three brontos and stuff on the beach, but he's managed to kill everything except this one parasaur. There's a Pelagornis. There's a bag on the beach from one of the Brontos, but the T-Rex went down that way until he went out of view range, so I'm going to probably probably take the boat down there and see if he's still down there anywhere. This is some really shallow water right here. You can basically just get out of your boat and walk around right here. Don't know how far it goes like this though. I'm kind of wanting to explore around these islands today. Uh oh, he's still a going, so he ain't done yet. I guess he just got out of render range, so it quit fighting. Maybe the Bronto will win and I can clean up the what's left of the wrecks. Maybe get some items. Thought the wrecks done killed all of them. Well, they're coming right for me though. I'm gonna have to move. Nope, the Rex won. How badly damaged is the Rex? Can't tell, but I'm not going to get anywhere near it. Oh, he's found that other parasaur, so I guess he's fixing that. Nope, Pelagornis. You want to try to kill a Pelagornis? Yep, I got to go. Yep, let's go explore this little islands out here. We haven't done that yet. We're basically made it most of the way around the map now. And we've got four vultures is all the tames we've got. So we really haven't done very much. This is some really shallow water through here, ain't it? And I've got that Rex out of the spawn range now. I kind of want to see what's on these islands out here. Haven't explored these yet. This is all the way to the south, southwest tip of the map. I'm probably going to try to get on around the map today. See if I can connect both sides of it together. But I want to check these little islands out first. Might be a reasonable base location over here somewhere. Haven't really thought about building a base yet, but I'm gonna look around. Main thing I want is a safe spot. These rocks look kind of weird here. I'm thinking I'm going to get off here and whack in a few of these and see what I get. If there ain't nothing to kill me. I've been kind of leaving my vultures on my boat while I'm exploring and stuff. I probably should be taking them with me, but... Let's see if this is just regular rock. I believe it is just regular rock. I need stone pretty bad, so let's change weapons here. Change to my hatchet. And I need wood pretty bad, so I'm going to do a little bit of resourcing right here. While it looks safe, and then I'm going to head on around this island. We got palm trees here. This might be a good place for a base location. Probably pretty warm temperatures. It is really a long, long ways away from the Redwood Forest, though. Actually, it's really a long ways from anything. I 
guess I pull out my map here and show where it is. I am all the way down at the bottom on the southwest corner of this map right now. And I'm going to chop down one more tree, then I'm going to go on around this island and see what's around the other side of it. That gives me a little bit of resources. There's a yellow supply drop way over there, but I am not able to open those yet. I've got pretty good stacks of wood now. Let's get on with it. Let's get around this island and see what it looks like. Get myself stuck in this little cove here. This would probably be a real nice base location over here. The only thing so far I've seen dangerous is that T-Rex and the water is so shallow it could probably walk right across there. It probably wouldn't be too big a chore though to tame, chore to tame that T-Rex though. It was only level 95. Tame it or kill it. We got sticking up here seaweed. I'm going to explore around the edge of this island, fill in some more of my map. See if there's any creatures at all on these islands. This might very well be some of the safest places to build over here. Don't know though. Never played this map enough to find that out. Over there's an island all to itself, a little one. There's an Anki. I wouldn't mind having a good Anki at some point. Let's see, where's my scope at? I've got everything on different buttons than I had before. as a level 60 Anki. So we do have Ankies on this island. There's another Anki, ain't it? Level 140, that is a really good one. Wonder if there's metal and stuff up there. Got Ankies around. I'm thinking I'm gonna look a little bit. Yep, yeah, bugs coming after me. Got bugs and Ankies back there. Where'd the bugs go? Now we got parasitheriums up here and morilla tops and something else running along there, gallimimus. Let's see, there's probably some other stuff here if there's these creatures. Kangaroo. Those are all pretty docile creatures. If you don't damage them or anything, they won't do nothing to you. It's going around this bigger part up here. I think I see some Lymatria up here. There's bound to be predators up here of some sort. I don't know what they'd be though. This is a really big island. Probably Rexes and Allosaurs and Carnos and everything up there. I don't see nothing though. Pretty good ridges around. Let's go check out the little island out here. Lots of Pelagornises around. This would be a nice little private island to build on if there ain't no predators on it.
Maybe, I don't know. Don't know. There's probably his printer. Now there's a Dimetrodon. And a Dimetrodons and Dimorphodons. Can I go through here or will I just get stuck and get attacked by something? This might be a mistake trying to go through here. This is going to be called Dimorphodon Island, I guess, because there's Dimorphodons everywhere. And one single Dimetrodon. Which I may wind up taming a Dimetrodon because they're really good about hatching Argentavis eggs. Don't have to build air conditioners if you got those. There's another one. Let's have a look, see. 25, you ain't a very good one. Check my map again, see what we got going on here. Yep. I don't know if that's actually a, an island way out there or not. Let's just go on around this little island and circle this big island. And then we're going to try to connect these maps up today if we can. There's a big archway looks like up on that big island, way up on the hillside up there. I don't know, I'm not ready to settle down just yet, I'm just exploring the map. I really like that little point out right there, that'd probably be a nice place for a base. And this island would be too probably. I'm going to go ahead and circle it. See what I can find. I still need to tame me a good parasaur, I think. And I do remember seeing a few higher level ones way on around the map. may try to tame one of those today if I get back in time. I'm wanting to know what this little deposit is right here. I think that is probably sulfur right there. Let's find out. Looks like sulfur, doesn't it? Yeah. Found some sulfur deposits on this island. I think you can make stuff with this, like, uh, I forget what it's called now, propelling, I think. Well, I'm loading up on it, ain't I, with this one rock. Go ahead and mine this. I don't know if there's any more around this island or not. Sure get a lot of it though for these two little deposits. And I'm exhausted now. I was about to say that looked like metal right here, but it's just a regular rock. Oh really? Bugs? I dislike bugs. Let's see if we can get out of here before I get my vultures triggered. Try not to trigger my vultures. Got them on passive. Keep them on the boat that way. I'll just leave the bugs alone for now. Got some sulfur and stuff. Don't know what I'm going to do with it. But I'm going to finish exploring this island. It seems to be really bad for bugs. I don't like bugs. And it's a little bit hot over here. I've got that hot symbol down on the bottom. Bottom right hand side of my screen. 
pretty cool looking. Could really make a fortress up there. Wow, there is a Spinosaur. I cannot get near a Spinosaur on a raft. It will destroy me. Let's just swing real wide here and try to get around it. I would like to scope it. I'm about afraid to stop, though. Is he dead? This will probably get me killed just looking. 20. You're a pretty bad one. Let's get on around here. We don't want to deal with a Spinosaur. And we sure don't want to tame a level 20 one. Even if we were prepared to do that. We know where a Spinosaur is now. I think that is the first one we've seen on this map so far. What is this up here in the water? A Pelagornis? Yep. There's one just standing on the water. Is he actually standing on a, a shark? Thought I was getting hit, but the Pelagornis was. Let's keep up boating. We still like a lot having our maps connected. I guess this is as good a place as any probably to stop and check our map. Yeah, we still like a lot getting everything connected here. Like the whole west coast. We can probably travel that pretty fast, and I do know the swamp is down through here somewhere, and I'll have to swing really wide when I go down there. I have to swing out really wide from that swamp because I'll get snakes and everything up on my boat. Baryonyxes and Caprosuchuses and Sarcos. Well, that's not an ominous looking little valley at all. Save the exploring on foot till I get better armor, I think. Save more islands out in there. No, it's pretty barren out that way, ain't it? Start heading north again at the west coast and see what we can find. I think we pretty much went all the way around this little island right here. I guess let's head over to this other little island and go around it. I see something moving over there. Looks like an iguanodon. Yep, I think we've got iguanodons and kangaroos and gallimimuses over here. An iguanodon would be a really fast mount, but I don't think they harvest berries. I don't really remember. Let's have a look at him. I can remember how to get my scope out, that is. Hit the wrong button. And I can't find him. Riyadi Guanadon. And a kangaroo, that Guanadon disappeared. Oh, he's got way over here. Level 20, boy. Was everything level 20? I'm going to get a little bit of water in my canteen, I think, while I look like a half halfway safe area to do it in. What else do I see over in this mess? I'm gonna look. I'll probably find bugs. I thought there might be a little pond over here. Drowned dolphin. If it ain't dead, that would be a really easy one to tame. What level are you, Dolphin? 
Looks like there's two of you, ain't they? 20? No, that ain't two. That's just a really wide mouth. Everything's level 20 over here. I don't know what I would do with the dolphin anyway. He'd just have to follow my boat around and something would kill him pretty soon. Shark or something would just get him. So I got no business taming one. Let's get on around the island here so we can fill out some more of our map. There's a nice big rock sticking up way over in the distance. Vultures, how did yuns get moved around? Did something attack yuns? You should not be over here. Don't know how you got there. And you guys are moved too, so something's happened. Something happened while I was gone. And they're on passive, so if anything would have attacked them, they would still been here because they wouldn't kill nothing on passive. So I don't know why they moved. Might to put some sticky on their feet because they cannot stand still on a boat. I probably shouldn't have tamed the vultures, but I was kind of feeling feeling vulnerable and thought they might be a little bit of protection. And they were easy to tame, and I'd never tamed vultures before. So I tamed up a few when I was in the desert the other day. Probably won't get a lot of use out of them. If something attacks me on the boat, though, you can bet I'm going to whistle neutral just instantly. They'll have a bunch of vultures to deal with when I do that. And I know when I get to the swamp, it's probably going to be cap roads. I'll probably get jumped by one while I'm going by, or a baryonyx. I have got stunned off of boats by baryonyxes before, which is terrible. That is a raptor. What is a raptor doing over here? This is not as safe as area as I thought it was. Seen very few raptors on this map so far, but there is definitely some right there, and I'm getting a heat stroke again. Shouldn't stop there. There's something fighting. What is fighting? Morella tops on something. Probably raptors. We're in the desert islands, I guess, over here. Something's chasing me. Let's move before I look back. We can't let a raptor board our boat. That would be a disaster. Which I think that's what it was. No, I don't see it now. So maybe it wasn't. Got lots of Pelagornises flying around. And there is another Gallimimus and another Moss Chops. I really would like to have another Moss Chops. Is this area safe? Kangaroos. Let's go see what the Moss Chops wants. We might get us a replacement for Greybone. That would be great if we could. What do you want? I got some prime fish. You want Tinto Berry, so what level are you? Are you another low level one? Oh, I don't have no tinto berries on me. I hope I got some. Let's put this sulfur up and grab some tinto berries, and we are still hot. Don't know what I'm gonna do with that sulfur, but I got it. Hope I got some tinto berries stashed in my fridge. Oh, there's another one. Let's see what level he is. You are a 20. We'd rather have the 55. And we already got some berries for him. Oh, that only got you to 39%. Okay, didn't mean to do that. There is a Pega Mustax. Stay away from Pega Mustax. This guy's going to want some kind of prime cooked meat here in a minute, and I won't be able to give him that. 
that stupid pago comes over here I'm gonna lose something good probably and I'm not gonna be happy about it come on quit throwing the vulture Well, let's see if he's hungry yet. Nope, not yet. I'm gonna put this vulture up. Stay right there now. Hoping this guy, well, that stupid Pago is getting too close. Hope he wants some berries of some sort. Got for me, Gally. What is that noise? Why am I not picking these? Don't know. Come on, get away from that Pegamistax. Oh, great. What'd you steal? What'd you steal off of me? Oh, you stink. I don't know what it got. My luck, something good. Come on, give me my stuff back. Thatch is all you got. I gotta find my moss chops again. Where'd you go? It's probably hungry by now. I hear bugs, of course. I'm gonna unleash the vultures if you don't quit. Where did that moss chops go? Is that him? Are you the 55? You are. What do you want now? Rare flyers. I got rare flyers, don't I? think so. This guy's going to take three feeds, but it'll be worth it. I'll have a berry collector again. He's going to want giant bee honey after I give him this, probably. Just mess it all up. 79%. He's still at 100% taming effectiveness. That is great. Now, if he just doesn't want primed cooked meat or giant bee honey the next time I should be able to tame him I guess I could cook up a little fish meat just in case he wants cooked fish meat don't think I have any of that cooked yet so let's do that that might be a possibility I've got cooked prime fish meat but I don't have any regular This guy be real handy for me. Hopefully one more feed will tame it. I'll probably get Pegamus stacks tacked again here in a minute. Let's put those rare flyers out of my slot there in case I do get attacked again. They'll take those Meiju berries if they take anything. I think is how it works. Come on, get hungry again. I need a replacement moss chops. What is going on here? Kangaroo? What is that? I see something down in the ground. Well, great.
You better not mess up my team, bug. Come on, are you hungry yet? Prime fish meat. I got you covered, buddy. I got prime fish meat. That's fortunate that I actually got that earlier. Fortunate for you, I got some prime fish meat cooked up. Oh no. Raw prime fish meat, you're kidding me. Oh, can't believe it. There's no way I'm going to get raw prime fish meat. That just kind of stinks. I've got cooked prime fish meat. Raw just doesn't keep. Raw prime fish meat. Boy, you stink. You picked, found the one thing, I, one of the one things I didn't have. There's a few more things I don't have. Yep, dang it. I thought I was going to get me a... Thought I was going to get me a moss chops for sure there. But that's out the window. The only way I can get prime fish meat is if a shark or something happens to ground itself. Raw prime fish meat. Well, dang. Let's get on around the island. That just ain't going to happen. Wasted a lot of time right here. Let's put this out and get on with it. Shouldn't be cooking meat and stuff while I'm doing this. And I'm mad about my moose chomps now. I thought for sure I'd have him tamed up. I had just about everything except for probably raw fish meat and raw prime fish meat anyway. And prime, regular prime meat. I ain't got none of that. Of course, I could get that. I could kill a parasitherium and get prime meat. If there was some saber tooth salmon close by, I could possibly get some. Let's look around here. Let's see if there's any fish in these little pools of water here. If there is, I might still possibly be able to tame that guy. If I could find a... There's a manta ray. Does manta rays give prime fish meat? I kind of doubt it. There's another one. Kind of thinking saber tooth salmon is about the only thing, uh, other than whales and stuff, and sharks. I did get some prime off a of shark. Dolphins. What do dolphins give you? Just regular meat, probably. I don't know if dolphins even give you fish meat. I think they just give you regular meat. There is some fish. No, that is trolobites. Trolobites just give you regular meat also, don't they? There's raptors. Stay away from raptors. I don't even know which way I'm going. I'm going to have to pull out the map and see which way I'm going here. I'm totally unsure. There's the obelisk. I need to be going back toward that one, I think. Yep, and over there is the snow-capped mountain, so that's the main area. 
I'm not going to be able to tame the moss chops. It's going to have to go on. Prime fish meat's just too hard to get. I guess it could have asked for giant bee honey and that would have been about the same result. I've got a long ways to go here. And there's the green obelisk, and I think down there is probably the blue one, which is basically where I started at. I see some parasaurs. I might tame a parasaur today. I see a tech one. Be nice if it was a 180 tech one. Let's have a look, see here. We do have stuff to tame with now, I think. Stuff to tame a parasaur with. Would love to have a 180 tech parasaur. Oh, that's a 24. That one's really bad. That's a 140 there, though. What do I see coming up behind it? A dillo? A couple of dillos. That's a 140 dillo, and he's after the tech parasaur. Dodos. I don't know. I think I'm going to keep looking. I'm going to find a better one. We got compies fighting dillos over here, which will win on this. Looks like some of the compies are dead already. And the dillo is a 150. So if that thing wins, I might just go tame a 150. Dillo. That would be really good, wouldn't it? Get a little off away from it so it doesn't get on my boat. I am definitely thinking about taming a 150 dillo. Let's set up and do that. Question is, is do I have enough meat? I guess I could kill something else on the beach. Let's see if we can bolo him. I don't know if I've ever boloed a dillo, dillo before or not. Come here, Dillo. Guess you can. Maybe this will work for me. Take only another... Nope, one that done it already. Okay, we need some meat now. What is that noise? Is there something attacking? I guess let's go kill those other dillos and feed them to the 150. You are the 150, aren't you? Yep. Where'd they go? Right there's one of them. I can't get aimed at him good. That was a 140. Dang, I didn't know that. Shouldn't have killed that one, I don't guess. Need some more, I think. We didn't get very much for that one. There's some dodos. I was thinking there was another dillo or two around here. Need enough meat to tame up that 150. There's another dillo. Need enough meat to tame up that 150 dillo we got knocked out. Where are you going chasing that parasaur?
Uh oh. Too much stuff. to die. Wow, that was really bad. Tied to a dildo. Go. We're gonna kill a dillo. I'm gonna get revenge. I got stuck on rocks and couldn't get away from it. Come on, get that thing. I don't know what you are doing. Now I need to collect some meat to feed that 150 dillo before it, something happens to it. Oh, that ain't enough, is it? Yep, that was really bad. Died to a dillo, and here it is about dark. Land on the boat, please. Which one of you got the meat off of that dillo up there? Not you. One of you's got it. Okay, there we go. Take this to my dillo over here. He lost a bunch of levels I seen when I was feeding him. Needed to feed him some prime meat, I think. Yep, he's lost a bunch. That stinks. Take my cooked meat back. And I'm probably going to call it a night here. I've got this 150 dillo knocked out and it is dark. And I don't even have my armor on. But anyway, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And thanks again for watching. This is Ta Creek Rock on Ragnarok signing out.